more of today on this Funding Monday, and it's time for a look at me now, the Joy Fit Club, where we showcase one person's incredible journey to shed those extra pounds. The newest member is 27-year-old Emily Pollock. Emily's lost a whopping 130 pounds, and it changed her life. Let's take a look at her story. I have always struggled with my weight, even as a child. Growing up, my love for sports helped me to keep my weight down. It wasn't until after high school that I really began battling obesity along with a host of medical problems. I saw several doctors who simply sent me home with depression medication and told me to go on a diet. When I married my sweet husband a few years later, I packed on another 60 pounds, putting me at almost 270 pounds. My lowest point came when a doctor told me that we couldn't have children because of my weight and health. No woman wants to hear that. Though I had finally been diagnosed with autoimmune hypothyroidism, I used it as an excuse, assuming it was my destiny to be fat. I didn't have a big event in my life that made me decide to make a change. I just looked in the mirror one day and wondered why I had been lying to myself for so long. I asked myself, am I truly happy? Is my marriage thriving? What kind of role model would I be as a mother? I knew I had to make a change, so I braved up and fought back. Now, 130 pounds lighter and an active runner, I have never been so happy. My marriage is thriving and my energy is incredible. I am proof that it is possible to overcome what may seem like the impossible. Wow, what a doll. Terrific. Okay, before we ask Emily to come out, we're going to talk with the leader of the pack, Joy Bauer. She's going to tell us more about her eating she habits. She is adorable. Uh, yeah. And I love that her newfound passion for health has inspired friends and family to lose weight oh, and increase their health as well. Mm -hmm. So. We're in the midst of the holidays. Mm -hmm. I wanted to give her some sort of a holiday health gift. So I said, Emily, back in the olden days mm -hmm. when you were heavier, what were your absolute favorite fattening fare? Mm -hmm. Cheesecake. Yeah. A regular restaurant portion is about 750 yeah. plus like calories. The palm, the palm yeah. is bigger than that. Yeah. It's huge, yeah. So I made for her a healthy version. This is a cheesecake dip. It's a fraction oh, of the calories. And all I did is I mixed um, non-fat cream cheese with a little bit of non-fat sour cream or Greek yogurt. Either works. A touch of brown sugar, vanilla extract, and cinnamon. And you can dip, dip it with your fruit. Stuff yeah. In. Okay. Oh, and of course, I'll put that out on Twitter and mm -hmm. Facebook for our viewers. Okay. Next, fettuccine Alfredo. Oh, it's a heart attack on a plate, right? Oh, Over 1,400 calories. So in my version for Emily, I took fat-free evaporated skin milk, and I mixed it with a little light cream cheese, and it gives you this creamy, velvety, delicious flavor for a fraction of the calories. Is pasta in there? Is there I, a wheat pasta? It's whole wheat, wheat pasta. pasta. I put sautéed mushrooms, sun-dried tomatoes, okay. and some grilled chicken, and you get a hearty portion for under 500 calories. All right, let's look Good at Emily's picture. <laughs> 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 All right, Emily, come join the Joy Fit Club. Girl is on fire! Oh, my God! Weight loss took t took some time. How long yes. when you finally decided that this is the time? How long did it take? It took about a year and a half to two years to lose the weight, but it was probably about a year ago when I really just kicked it into high gear. And you're That's a runner, right. you're saying, right? Yes. Did, how did you start that? Slowly. Yeah, <laughs> walking. Was it a walking yeah, thing yeah. First? I couldn't run more than three minutes to start, but yeah. every day I just went out there and I kept pushing and I kept trying. And she gets whistles now oh. when she runs. Oh. Oh. And what does your husband think of this new you? Yeah. <laughs> Curtis, good. you'll get your chance. <laughs> Curtis is back in the kitchen. Whistling. Whistling. whistling at you. Now, how's your energy level changed and all the health issues that you were concerned about? Amazing. Fertility and things. I've got so much energy. It's incredible. And mm -hmm. I just had a tech up with my doctor recently and everything was just fantastic. Wow. Everything came back great. So your so. chances to be a, a mother someday are, are much increased. Yes. Huh? Oh, that's <laughs> such a great Any yeah. advice for people at home who, who are kind of at the before stage where you were? Any advice for them? Um, don't rush it. Don't yeah. try and push too hard to start with. Take baby steps and realize it's going to take time. You're going to plateau. You're going to have rough spots. Right. Don't quit when you yeah. have a... But it a, works and it happens. Well, congratulations. Hard off. Congratulations. Look at you. I keep going to put their hands on the hips like that. Half of Emily. Awesome. All yeah. right.